Hi guys, as promised, I'm back with another video showcasing the exciting SketchUp 2024 update. This time, I want to highlight the seamless process of sharing your SketchUp projects with your client, as now you can effortlessly generate a viewable link that your clients can open in any browser to explore the project in more detail. So let's get started. Here have one of my kitchen projects, my Santa Monica project, that I want to share with my client. And as you can see, I have multiple scenes in here as well. I obviously used the new ambient occlusion for my scenes to make it look more realistic. Now let's have a look at how I can share this file with my client. First, select File, Trimble Connect, Share a Link. A new pop-up will appear saying that you need to actually save this file first to Trimble Connect in order to share it. So let's save it to Trimble Connect. Usually, this should be empty if you're just starting to save anything in your Trimble account. I have previously tested this, so I have another project in here. I'm just going to save it inside this one, just as a test. It doesn't matter that much right now. I just want to show you quickly how it's done. So I double click inside the project and save my file. Notice the right symbol on here. Before it was a document symbol, meaning I had it saved on my desktop. Now it will change to a cloud. Be aware that once you do that, your file will not be updated on your desktop any longer if you click on save. It will be now saved in the Trimble Connect cloud. But you can always log in back into your Trimble Connect to download the file if you wish to have it saved on your computer as well. Okay, now that my file is saved in Trimble Connect, another window automatically opened up here where I can simply click on Create a Shareable Link. Now I can just copy this link, send it to my client and he can easily view the kitchen project in his or her browser. So this is the file opened in a simple browser. It took a bit of time to load, but once it did, this is exactly what you will get. Let's have a quick look what options we have. We have a select tool. Then, this is nice, the client can actually use the tape measurement tool to recheck some measurements in here as well. Then we have the hand tool, an orbit tool, and some zoom options. And of course the camera position tool. You can see it's a view-only version of this file, so your client can't really move or break anything in here. On the right side, under Entity Info, you could let the animation of your scenes play here, even though it is a bit slow for me. I could try another browser, maybe that will speed it up, but just so you know, you can actually choose different scenes under my scenes. Certainly, if your client is not so computer handy, maybe just stick to a top-down perspective where he can just use the orbit tool and move around. I'm sure he will be already impressed. You could even display tags if you have some. And some more information about your model. So now let me actually remove the table with the chairs in my SketchUp model, save it and see what happens. So after making some adjustments and saving my file, moving back to my browser and refreshing, refreshing the link, you can see it does update new changes you have made previously. So for instance, if your client asks you to adjust something in the project, you can now easily make the changes, save the file, and since it's saved in Trimble Connect, it will be reflected for your client using the same link. Okay guys, I hope you liked this quick video and can't wait to share your projects now super easy with a shareable link. See you soon, have a wonderful day.